If I wanted to lose 10 pounds in one month, here's what I would do. But before I tell you, if you found this video helpful, why not give me a follow for more no bullshit content like this? So here's what I would do. I would stop focusing on losing weight as quickly as possible. Seems counterproductive, right? Well, how has losing weight quickly worked out for you in the past? If you're watching this video, obviously it hasn't. You've likely been losing the same 10, 20 pounds your entire life. So there's the harsh truth that you need to understand before we go any further. Here's what you need to know. Quick weight loss is not sustainable weight loss. And the methods that you took to lose the weight are the same methods that you will be using to keep the weight off. So the question becomes, can you do that crash diet for the rest of your life? Probably not. Can you look at me right now in my eyes and say, Matt, I never want to eat a carb again. I fucking hate carbs. Or Matt, I love eating 1200 calories. It just makes me feel so good. I want to do that for the rest of my life. No, you can't do those things. And if you tell me you can, I'm going to assume you're a liar or a psychopath. So if you want to know where to get started, start by building every meal that you have around protein. Just one to two palm sizes of protein. That's all you need. Now take half of the plate and fill it up with either fruits or vegetables. And you can use your handy dandy fist as one serving. Now what I want you to do is fill in the rest of your plate with carbs, about one cupped handful of carbs. And we're missing one more thing here. We're missing fats, about one to two thumbfuls of fats. That's all you need. Congratulations, you are now learning how to build a balanced plate. Use those suggestions, tweak them to your liking and to what makes you feel good. Do that three times a day and you are going to be crushing it. And one last thing, don't forget to allow yourself to eat your favorite fun foods. They're not off limits.